Hello everybody and welcome back to another video with Electra Soul. If you're new to my channel, I'm a psychic medium, a spiritual life coach, and just a spiritual bitch putting everybody on alongside a whole lot of other things. But today in this video, what we are going to be discussing is straight up how to manifest people away, okay? No matter who it is that you're manifesting away, doesn't matter who it is, if it's someone who really irks you, who's really annoying, okay? If there's someone who's toxic, they just won't leave you alone, if they've been kind of on your ass lately, it doesn't matter who it is like I was stating. It could be anybody, anybody who you simply just don't want to have bother you anymore, you know? Especially if they're an ex that you're like, oh my gosh, can they stop? That's completely fine and understandable in every way, shape, and form. So today we're gonna be discussing how to actually do that. And as you all know, as I've stated within all my other how to manifest videos, same formula, same thing. We're simply going to be discussing the specific manifestation of manifesting them bitches away, especially if you're done with it. You don't want to deal with that anymore. All it takes is for you to take your mental focus off of that thing and place it onto something that you do actually want to see more of within your reality because of course this is your life you're in control everything's working out for you and you are never bothered because everyone is so kind so good and so amazing to you everyone is literally such a rose to be around you love them all okay they're all amazing everyone who's in your life who's blessed enough to actually be in your life they're all amazing because why wouldn't they be it's you of course no one bothers you absolutely not okay and so we kind of already got started with the video because that's dead ass kind of step number one all right but besides that let's just get started with the video right now so that we can get to talking about how to manifest these people away especially if you're tired of it okay when it comes to you manifesting those people away whoever it is whether again it's an ex or someone who's been on your ass for a few years now or intending it's not a few years but they've been on your ass even if it's been a day or two and you're tired of it you don't want to deal with it any longer it's a really annoying professor i don't care whoever a neighbor okay just putting on examples or even someone at your job actually that's a big one okay managers at your job maybe a supervisor please leave me the fuck alone yeah all right the one thing that you're gonna do as everything else when you want to manifest something away from your life you're going to take your focus off of that thing all right these people might be really annoying these people might be consistently on you nagging you telling you this that the, well, you're tired of it though you don't want to hear it anymore because you are tired of hearing about it you are now going to stop within your mind acknowledging the fact that this person is so unbelievably annoying they will not stop bothering me okay and the reason that you're gonna do that is because from my own personal example i know that anytime that i said oh my god God, they're so annoying can they please stop it would just persist and I would say that yes it would definitely persist as well because I had the assumption that they weren't gonna stop and then boom they would just continue being after me annoying me doing this and that but it was because I also had the assumption that they would and I knew that because I didn't want to deal with it any longer the one thing I had to do was to stop putting my focus towards that person and that thing especially mentally speaking okay because within the mind that is where everything manifests if you believe that people are gonna be annoying you or even if you are one of those people who when you go out you always assume oh these motherfuckers are so annoying everyone's always bothering me why can't they just leave me alone and you know that energy is not something that you want to be reflecting or thinking about within your reality especially if you don't want to be bothered that is why it's so important to assume in favor of the fact that everyone who surrounds you and everyone who knows you and everyone who is blessed enough to be in your life these are all people that deserve a place who are really great for you and who in fact do not annoy you in any way shape or form you do not want to be dealing with people that you find to be bothersome okay you are much stronger than that you understand like you're someone who you just can't settle for that and you can't let these exes and these ex best friends and these people these stalkers online and monitoring spirits and all this junk be anything that has a place or even plays a role within your reality you can't be that person you got to be someone who are focusing on the people who are right for you who are actually meant for you because you said so and who are positive and smart and with enough good energy to actually exist within your reality you know what i'm trying to say here this is all about your focus okay so as you are learning to shift your focus from oh my gosh these people are so freaking annoying you're gonna move it over to i'm completely fine because i only have good people in my life there's only people who deserve to be around me that exist around me there are people in my life who want to bless me there are people in my life who are actually meant for me there are people in my life that i actually want to have around me to experience my life with you understand you're gonna start putting your focus towards the people who do deserve that from you and you're not going to let these people who have been bothering you or this person be a reason that you are bothered any longer you know and even if you are bothered that is completely okay you know you can have the feelings that you have of course it is annoying especially if an ex keeps hitting you up or just someone from your past and even just a person around you that you don't like the energy of or anything like that you're going to stop putting them on a pedestal in your mind in the way that you assume this is something that will persist they're so annoying they won't leave me alone you are manifesting that in that moment and i do not want any of you guys to manifest that i want you guys to stay focused on the fact that 
those who exist around you, again, are people who are meant for you. And that anyone who's not meant for you, anyone who is bothering the hell out of you, you're not gonna deal with that any longer, all right? You really have to be as strict as this because I mean, this is your life, this is your reality. You cannot be someone who's settling for anything less than what you want. No matter who it is, no matter what the history is, no matter what place they have in your life. Oh, but he won't leave me alone because he's my boss. Oh, she won't stop because she's my neighbor and she's been doing this for years. Baby girl, if you want it to stop, it's time to shift that focus all the way. Okay, we're gonna look the other way and we're gonna say, no, nah, no, no longer a factor in my life does not matter. It does not matter at all. You don't have to suppress your feelings of annoyance or anything like that. But all I'm asking is that you switch your perspective a little bit so that these people that you feel as though are draining your soul, they no longer have the power to do that to you any longer. My ex has moved on. They left me alone. My neighbor, finally, she just goes into her house and she doesn't say a damn thing to me any longer. I'm so happy about it. Oh my God, that weirdo on Instagram, they stopped commenting. I'm so happy. All of these good things that you can dead ass say to yourself. These are things that will be reflected within your reality. And as someone again, who has manifested hella people to leave me the fuck alone. And I'm not saying anyone from an external perspective. I mean, people that I knew, people from my past, people who did me wrong, even exes, all that stuff. Babe, I'm not gonna put you on a pedestal any longer. They weren't even on the good pedestal. They were on the negative pedestal. And I think that that honestly is something that's way worse than anything else. Because what I mean by a good pedestal and a negative pedestal, I guess you say like a positive pedestal and a not so positive pedestal is that on the positive pedestal, this might be something that you actually really want, okay? I really want this person to hit me up. I really want this person to look after me. I really want them to be after me where it's only positive because you really want that thing. It's still not a good thing to put anyone on a pedestal, okay? If it's not you, they should not be on your pedestal. But on the other hand, the negative pedestal that I'm referring to is placing these annoying ass people all the way up here saying they will not leave me the hell alone. You see how my hand cuts off? Yeah, you're putting them all the way up here. F these people, it does not matter. On the day that you peeped, oh my God, they left me alone. Oh, thank God. Keep that with you. Okay, if one day they stop hitting you up, stop saying things to you, they just don't look at you, keep that energy with you, please. And do not start assuming, oh, they left me alone today, but who knows next time? Oh, but what if it comes back? Nope, absolutely not. You are not gonna start claiming that shit again. You're going to say, oh my God, they left me alone? Bet, perfect. Right then and there, I manifested that. Yes, you are, and yes, you did. Because that is exactly what you did. You manifested the fact that they left you alone. So where's, you know, why are you gonna reclaim it? Next week, they'll be back. Next week, they'll be on my ass again. Tomorrow, it'll be different. No, it's not. It's gonna be perfect because they no longer exist to you. It's done just like that. And what is the one thing that you're doing here that's manifesting all this? You're removing your focus from that person. That is exactly why they are not bothering you any longer. It's because you're no longer placing them in that perspective that these people will continue to bother you. That negative pedestal that I was talking about, yeah, it's tanked, ho. You're on the pedestal. And that person could not matter less, okay? They could not matter less because they're all the way at the bottom. It's over. It is over for the both of y'all in the best way possible. You cut ties and that is final. Oh my goodness. It feels like heaven knowing that I no longer have to be bothered by this person. It does not have to be more complicated than what I'm telling you that it is. Thankfully, it does not. Because no matter which way you choose to go about manifesting this, either way, it is going to work. Some people love to script and write things like this down where this person no longer bothers me, it is over. And that right there is something that that person will genuinely believe this will manifest because they are writing it down, you know? They have that intention all the way through that this will come true because I, I already said it and I wrote it down on paper so now it's permanently embedded within the universe and then boom, it's dead ass gonna manifest for you. So why trip about anything else? And I will say that people who have manifested people away, if it's not using affirmations, affirming and persisting, a lot of people love to script about this. And I honestly agree with that because personally from my own past, yeah, I scripted that some people would leave me alone and they did. They always did because I intended that. Or even if their energy was still pestering after me, I write it down, no longer ho, cut the fuck off. Remove the cord from the soul so that the roots come out too and it's done. You see, all that is a manifestation within myself, a conscious manifestation that ends up manifesting for real because I intended to and that's it. And on the other hand, with affirmations, if you want to affirm and persist, this person left me alone, like I was stating earlier. They finally got the hint. They no longer want to talk to me. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy that they left me alone. They don't want anything to do with me anymore. They're not in my life. We both moved on. We're both happy on our own. We don't have any interest in one another any longer. It is done. They don't have any interest in 
me, anything. You can say anything that you want. You can be specific, say names. You can generally just say they, that person, whoever. As long as you know who you're talking about, that is the most important thing, all right? You never have to be super specific if you don't want to. I know that in the past, I was kind of specific. I would say their name and stuff like that, but I would just leave it there, you know? I wouldn't say their whole name and their middle name and their date of birth. I'd just be like, this person left me alone and boom, clap, boom, de clap, de clap, it's over. And then it would dead ass manifest in that way. So if there is any way that you will choose to manifest that these people leave you the hell alone, the only thing that I recommend is that you manifest it in a way that makes you feel the most powerful, all right? Another huge thing that I would do was visualize that these people would leave me alone and the way that I would do that is by simply visualizing that person walking through a door and shutting it or no, actually it would be myself. Yeah, I just remembered clearly because I haven't done this in a very long time, but I remember I would visualize that there was just a door there and I would open the door and I would walk through it and I would just leave that person right where they were. I would move on and that person would just leave me alone because they have no other choice but to. You know, this is my reality. No one's gonna tell me about me in my reality. No one's gonna follow me if I don't want them to in my reality. This is my reality for a reason. And that is the same exact way it is for you. You can visualize you leaving them right where you last saw them. You can visualize your neighbor walking into their house. If it is a neighbor who is annoying you consistently as opposed to imagining them coming up to you and saying mm -hmm, and all this shit complaining, right? Absolutely not. Visualize them going right into their house, shutting their door and not saying a single word to you. And then you go in your house and you're like, damn, this feels so good to be left alone. And yes, it does feel so freaking good to be left alone. No one has to bother you without your permission and as the creator, the most powerful person of your reality, I quite literally refuse, I rebuke that anybody messes with you, that anybody bothers you, that anybody follows you, that you don't want to have follow you. I refuse it. I literally rebuke it. I'm telling you right now. In Jesus' name, these people leave you alone. Clap. That's it. Because this is your life. And I'll be damned if I watch you be bothered by anyone that you don't want to be bothered with. Absolutely not. That is why personally, I am not bothered by a single soul. Believe me, I do not see a soul <laughs> that I don't want to be seeing within my reality. I kid you not. No one in this reality has enough power to override what I believe about myself. I believe that I deserve to be surrounded by people who deserve me, who are good to me, who are healthy to me, who have good intentions for me, good spirituality, all that good stuff. And it always manifests because I don't see anything else. I refuse it. And then once you finally get that perspective down all the way through, you can keep it up with you all the way through where now that no one's bothering you, no one is allowed to bother you ever again, okay? And as someone who, again, I let a lot of people bother me for a very long time. Once all those people were filtered out, it, I never went back. You know, it was never, this person won't leave me alone now and this is happening again. And but, Nope, absolutely not. I manifest against that. But more than me manifesting against it, because it's not me manifesting against it, it's more of me manifesting with my own peace you know so i'm not even focusing on me manifesting the negativity away being a factor but me manifesting peace consistently being a factor you know the positivity is what has a number one place in my life all right so yes oh my goodness <laughs> i truly intend my love like that's basically it for the video yes it is but before i do all of that and say all of that i want you all to understand that you can really do this as easily as you say that you can i promise you manifesting people away is not difficult it actually isn't the only thing that's difficult about it is the mental limitation that you feel that you may have about it where you think that no this person's not gonna leave me alone it's been too long or you assume that it's gonna be difficult because this person that or they're so persistent and I'm so used to it by now I can't imagine my life without it absolutely not you gotta unlearn that shit because those are all limiting beliefs that do not exist within your reality as the most powerful manifester of your reality you are a conscious manifester for a reason so let everything work in your highest favor you do not need to experience having to be bothered for the rest of your life because what absolutely fucking not no one's gonna be bothering you you. not in this reality not in this life you are the one who's in control and you put your foot down you have boundaries okay if they're not someone that you want to consistently experience within your reality it is over and besides that everyone is you pushed out so if you do want to assume that some of these people are actually really cool now and they're really nice and they're really all that good stuff you can totally do that and they will be like that believe me i have changed a lot of people in my reality to be a lot cooler to be with and a lot nicer and a lot purer and all this good stuff and then they ended up being that way for me so it wasn't even that for everyone I would manifest away and I would never see them again some people you know some people I just I didn't even want to bother myself with manifesting a different version of them I just wanted them out but for other people yes I would manifest a different version of them and that would still manifest for me and that right there was heaven on earth for real you can dead ass see the change through your assumptions but you got to be the person
person to make it happen. As always, y'all know you're in control, as always. So take that and keep that with you, my love. You all got this from the bottom of my heart. I truly intend that this video today helps you out to the most of its ability when it comes to manifesting these motherfuckers away. You're not gonna deal with a single person that you don't wanna be dealing with, and if you do wanna deal with them, but a different version of them, confidently manifest that version of them because you can, because you said so, and because you feel as though you are strong enough to do it, because you absolutely are, and that's it, all right? And so with that being said, my love, may God bless you all forever and always. Thank you guys so much again for watching today. I truly intend nothing but the best for you all and that only the best is following you, is with you, is accompanying you on your journey. All that good stuff. You deserve that. And that's it. All right. I will see y'all this Monday for another video. And really quick, guys, I forgot to mention, I wanted to thank you all so unbelievably much for 29K. Yay, bitch. Oh my gosh. I feel so happy, so blessed. And I feel so grateful to have such a wonderful audience like you all. Seriously, I have manifested the best versions of you all. Not a single soul bothers me. Nothing, just nothing because I don't focus on that and I don't manifest that. I only manifest the best and that is why you all are the absolute best for me. Thank you guys for watching me, for listening to me, for learning from me. I know that my videos are very versatile, I feel. There's a lot of different stuff on here and I'm just so happy that you all are so open-minded enough to learn from it all because I really am here for it all. You know, I'm never gonna stay in one single thing. I wanna just expand as much as possible to help out as many people as possible from every which corner. You know, everyone in this world is important. I love everyone the same, I truly do. And I know that everyone has the same kind of potential only the best potential so thank you guys for everything and thank you guys again for being so loyal to me and being so kind to me you all do not know what it means to me you really don't okay you really don't but i intend that you can feel it i really truly do my love thank you guys for everything you all are the best i love you all so much thank you guys thank you guys thank you guys but yes let's just continue up from here because it's only up from here as always thank you guys again so unbelievably much i love you all all right my love let's do this thing let's manifest the best of the best because we got the best and those motherfuckers who we don't want in our realities they're gone because we said so and that's it of course they don't exist to us we're too powerful for that we already knew that though i know you did all right because you said so and that's it yes you did period so yes let's manifest the best of the best of everyone okay not a single soul is going to be bothering us not at all and if you do like that person enough to change the version of that person that you are experiencing or even if you just want to do it period go ahead and do that but don't let a single soul bother you please okay we're manifesting the version of whoever away the fuck away you know they're going away whether it's from your life or from this reality where they are behaving this way and now they're the version that you want them to be all of it's going to be the way that you want it to be because you're not going to be sitting here bothered by a single thing absolutely not we're not doing that you're too good for that you're too powerful for that you're not about that other shit okay you got to be stronger than that and i know that you are but remember this all the way through because you really are the most powerful person of this reality you get to call the shots you get to decide what person and what version of that person gets to exist within your reality but you get to choose it okay so everything that i'm saying here take it on with full confidence in the fact that it is already done for you you know the best version of everyone not a single soul bothers you because why would they everyone that you want gone is gone and everyone that you want to stay but to be better for you is here that's the only version that exists and that's it all right take this with you please all right the advice the guidance all that it's everything that you are it's all the power that you got within you but make it happen let it happen you're in control now as you've always been but all right my love if it's not the best of the best you don't want it if it's bothersome you don't want it it got to be hella good for you and so it is everyone is of course this is your life no one deserves a place in your life if they're not the best duh they are the best because you are the best i mean that's the only thing that you have to experience that's it y'all got that as always so let's get it all the way up and thank you guys again so much for 29k i wish i said that on monday i completely forgot though but it's okay i remembered now that's the most important thing love you guys so much god bless you all and subscribe if you like what you see i've never said that no i have I think I had something in the past. No, whatever. But subscribe if you like what you see because it means the world to me. But love you guys. Bye. Oh, yeah. You better subscribe, actually, because I'm the person with the good vibes that you need. Of course. So you're going to manifest me and I'm here. So stay with me. Y'all got it. Bye.